Join Jason on his graduation day at the University of Tasmania. I'm studying law. I did my first two years um, in a college in Malaysia and the balance of my two years here in the University of Tasmania. I live in John Fisher College, which is part of the accommodation services under the university. And I love my room, the wheels, the view of it is fantastic. He uses the word college to refer to two different things. The college in Malaysia is, like the university in Australia, a tertiary education institution that awards degrees and diplomas. But the John Fisher College is part of the university where students like Jason live. Listen again. I'm studying law. I did my first two years um, in a college in Malaysia and the balance of my two years here in the University of Tasmania. I live in John Fisher College, which is part of the accommodation services under the university. And I love my room, the wheels, the view of it is fantastic. After two years here, um, yes, I'm graduating um, in a single degree in the Bachelor's of Law. I received um, a partial scholarship um, from a KDU college um, in which where I was studying. And um, to come here though, my parents um, funded for this and I'm really grateful for them. He's graduating. He's going to be given his degree. The noun is graduation. Yeah, it's important for us to, to come uh, out of Malaysia to, to this graduation. I think it's to give him the support, to tell him that we are, we are supporting him in what he's doing and we are really proud of him. And I think that, that kind of uh, moral encouragement is important to give him that boost to start him off on his career. Jason Lee Chun Jong. The verb is graduate. One of the best moments of my life to see my, my son graduate and uh, to see him uh, be on his own. Yeah, so sort of uh, letting him fly and be what he wants to be. It's a great feeling. Yeah, very good. But what do you call someone who graduates? <laughs> okay, now with all the other graduates. <laughs> I'm with all the other graduates. Someone who graduates is a graduate. Listen to the difference in pronunciation. Graduate, graduate. When he is still studying, he is an undergraduate. It means a lot to me that my parents and uh, my brother and aunt could come here. It's, it's a, a long journey and um, they're taking their time off. Uh, even my brother's skipping classes to come here. Um, and I'm quite, I'm, I'm very happy for them uh, to be there to celebrate this moment with me. Taking time off is not working and skipping classes is not going to classes. It really broadens the mind and it gives them a whole new environment where they can learn to, to flow in, to blend in with a new culture and to, uh, to realise the potential. I believe that uh, being in a new country helps them to realise the potential better. To broaden the mind, is to be exposed to different points of view and experiences. And to realise your potential is to do as well as you possibly can. And what is Jason going to do next? In the next few months, um, I'll still be here and um, I've had the opportunity to uh, work with a law firm um, on a small internship for a month. And um, then I'll start my um, course, um, the Masters in International Business. He's going to do another degree. But this time, while he is studying, he will be a postgraduate because he has already graduated with his first degree. But for the moment, he is enjoying his graduation. Yeah, I'm enjoying the Aussie beer right here, right now. Mm. Cheers! Celebratory drink.